Hi Taurus, welcome. Let's jump in and see what's going on here with you today, all right? Now this is a general reading, so of course it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. And uh, I do offer same-day personal readings. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you. All right, Taurus, I want to shuffle the cards out first and I'll tell you what I see here for you. No. No. Shh. What do you want? I don't know what you want. No. Because if you're cold, you made me take off your sweater. You're hungry, you got food. Thirsty, you got water. And I know you already went to the bathroom. And your cat box is clean. What? You want to say hello, Taurus? Remember, don't teach your cat to talk or be clingy if you can't deal with it. I feel like he was born this way, so I have to deal with it. Well, congratulations. Mage says hello. He wants to say hi to you, Taurus. I don't know why, but he wants to say hello to you. So, that's a good sign. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Fatty, go. I don't know what you're doing, what you're up to. Don't be mischievous. Yeah, you don't be mischievous, Tommy. Yeah. Okay. Don't be me. Uh, let's not wake father up here. <laughs> Sorry about that. But he likes you. He wanted to say hello today to you, Taurus. He's very particular, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, Taurus, so right away here. So something or someone is very irritating and frustrating to you, but you're trying to work with it and figure it out, and you do. Literally go to work. You do that. You know, you're hardworking and independent. You know what I mean? It's long-term. Whatever you got, you know it's stable as long as you keep focused on it, and you are, which is wonderful. And you're planning, okay? There's some plans that you're focused on. They're making you feel pretty good and comfortable with yourself and content, Okay. And um, in that sense, things are going really well here for you with that, okay? You're emotionally committed to something or someone, definitely yourself, of course, and you're choosing to be very loving and friendly and kind to others around you. And you're sleeping, you're getting your sleep, you're resting, you're recovering, maybe even vacation, rejuvenating, and then back to being productive, working on yourself and literally going to work and putting in the effort towards things. Now, you are very spiritual and intuitive. You Something happened where you got something confirmed, like you working on something here, you got your confirmation by doing that, which is really cool. And um, you're trusting your intuition with that. And whatever you're going through, good or bad, you're meant to be going through it. It's definitely destined to be in the situation. Okay. And so with that too, you know, there's a lot of changes happening. Now these changes, maybe they might be a little scary or shaky because right afterwards, it's this energy here where, oh, shh, be quiet. <laughs> yeah, but get your ass then i was gonna pick you up now you're no you're being piccolo quit being piccolo you're being a piccolo you're not you're gonna wake him up 
you're being piccolo. Shh. What are you doing? No. Quit waking him up. We're trying to. Mage. Don't start. Come here. Come here. Okay, you fight me? Fine. Anyway, you go cold in the situation. And I'm not sure. You're not allowed. Don't, don't be jumping up on the other. What are you doing? What are you doing? What do you see? Is it a bug? Oh. See, you woke him up. It's your fault. <laughs> These changes make you go cold. Or a person does. I don't know. After this, Taurus, you feel really fucking scared or limited or restricted or stuck or trapped. And then you feel anxiety and you're worried and you're, I don't know, something's going on here, okay? I left my husband a note. It says, play. Like, do you want to play? Yes, yes, Keebler. No, don't be trying to act all cute now. No, I'm telling on you because you were being a putz this morning. Now that he's awake, I'm tattletailing on everything you did this morning. Ass doodle. Now, please quit interrupting Taurus or me. I'm so sorry, Taurus. There, there's a lot of stress and anxiety. Let's just get to it. You feel bad. Something feels like shit, okay? Let's, let's, let's move on from the negative energy. Now, back to that. You're like, fuck it, let me go, okay? As in like, you're progressing, you're moving forward, you're planning, you're doing something, life is speeding up again. There you are now feeling grateful. You're, you got what you wanted, you're getting something that you want and it's working well with you here, okay? And you're being equal and giving and sharing to, with others and doing well with that, okay? And there you are with your public success and recognition. You're very successful. Things are going well there, online, offline, whatever it is. And that's where you want to go on a new journey and leap of faith. But then right after that, that fast year, Taurus, it causes you to feel, I don't know if you lost money, you feel left out, lack of, that you have to just walk away from it or that or them or whatever the situation is, okay? So let's see a little bit more here. You put. Now you stay quiet because he's awake. You're not allowed on there. Mm -hmm. Now, you do get confused, but then you end up making a decision of what it is you need to do. That fast, I think you get good news, you get a message, you relay something to someone, they do to you, you seek answers within you, you get your answers. Now, that you go getting crafty with your own spiritual path, position, whatever it is. You want to manifest and co-create something, and that's what you're in the workings of doing. And then at the same time, you know, there's this energy here where, for some reason, maybe it's another person that's into their craft, I don't know, or you. That's where you get guarded and put your walls up and defensive. But then, you, you set some boundaries, and that's where the truth comes out. Now, whatever truth this is, you're very freaking happy and excited. Now, you're ready to be authentic. Now you're ready to go on that successful path and journey. And that's what I have here for you. Okay. Sorry about that, by the way. <laughs> if you're a cat person though, and you have a boy cat and you're the mom, like you're the feminine, you know what the fuck you're going, what I'm going through right now. <laughs> I swear. It's like, you can't get upset because they're so fucking cute and they love you. Right? Like the good news is, right? Cause cats can tell, cats will tell you if you're evil. He loves me. Good news is I'm great. <laughs> He sees through my soul and I, you know what I mean? But he just, he's too much sometimes. <laughs> Clingy. Anyway, you could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Gemini, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Now I get to go scare my husband. Okay, bye. <laughs>